Welcome back, it's Back to the Basics. We are doing DR and DR. It's about disaster recovery, RPO, RTO, let's go. All right, welcome back, and we are talking DR. That's disaster recovery. So there's a number of ways you can think about disaster recovery. We can think about it from a stance of we lose a circuit, uh, we lose power, we lose the building, the facilities, whether it's a natural disaster like flood or fire, or we lose maybe a, a server or a storage node. All of those things can come around disaster, can fall into the category of disaster recovery. So there's two pieces of, or two elements that we use when looking at DR. RTO, recovery time objective, and RPO, recovery point objective. So the RTO is how fast you can recover from an outage. So for example, if I lose my compute infrastructure, how fast can I get that compute infrastructure back up, whether it's in our facility or not? RPO, if I lose my facility, how many days of data will I lose, like point in time, as I move uh, my data from or recover from a disaster? So for example, I lose my compute infrastructure or I lose my entire office because of flood or fire. Now the RTO, the recovery time objective, how fast can I get the infrastructure up? And the RPO is how many days of data did I lose? And so these two things, the RTO and the RPO, are really business drivers. They come from the business. And the shorter the duration of time of data you wanna lose um, could mean the incremental cost around bandwidth or technology to support that. And the RTO, the recovery time objective, if you shorten that down, that could mean also additional infrastructure. And now as we move into cloud and some of these architectures, we can get really effective RTO and RPO with some of the technologies that are out there that go on premise, that can do local backups, can shove those out to the cloud. And then you, with all these cloud resources like compute and network connectivity in the cloud, we can spin these resources up dynamically as we need them. So you're able to get better RPO and RTO uh, times to meet business requirements with the cloud. So that's it for DR. We've talked about RTO, RPO. We talked a little bit about leveraging the cloud to spin up resources faster. If I said anything in this video that you thought to yourself, hey, I'd love to know more about that, make sure you leave a comment, like, subscribe, and we will see you on the next Back to the Basics. Thanks for watching.